Hey guys, it's Mrs. Sensler. Today I'm going to read you the book Elmer by David Mickey. There was once a herd of elephants. Elephants young, elephants old, elephants tall and short, fat and thin. All were different, but all were happy and almost all were the same color. All except Elmer. Elmer was not elephant color. He was patchwork. Elmer was yellow and orange and red and pink and purple and blue and green and black and white. It was Elmer who kept all the other elephants happy. Their games and jokes were always his idea. If an elephant was laughing, the cause was usually Elmer. But Elmer himself wasn't happy. Whoever heard of a patchwork elephant, he thought. No wonder they laugh at me. One morning, just as the other elephants were waking up, Elmer slipped away. As he walked through the jungle, Elmer met other animals. Good morning, Elmer, they said. After a long walk, Elmer found what he was looking for. A large bush covered with his elephant colored berries. Elmer caught hold of the bush and shook it until the berries fell on the ground. Then Elmer laid down and rolled all over the berries. This way and that, he picked up bunches of berries and rubbed himself all over until he was covered with berry juice. When he had finished, there wasn't a sign of any yellow or orange or red or pink or purple, or blue, or green, or black, or white. Elmer looked like any other elephant. On his way back through the jungle, Elmer passed the other animals. Good morning, elephant, they said. When Elmer rejoined the, the herd, none of the other elephants noticed him. As he stood there, Elmer felt that something was wrong. But what? He looked around. Same old jungle, same old blue sky, same old rain cloud, same old elephants. The other elephants were standing absolutely still, silent and serious. Elmer had never seen them so serious before. It made him want to laugh. Finally, he could bear it no longer. He lifted his trunk and at the top of his voice shouted, Boo! The other elephants jumped in surprise. Elmer was helpless with laughter. Then the others began to laugh too. Too bad Elmer isn't here to share the fun, they said, laughing harder and harder. And then the rain cloud burst. When the rain fell on Elmer, his patchwork started to show. Again, oh, Elmer, gasped an old elephant as Elmer was washed back to normal. You've played some good jokes but this has been the biggest laugh of all. What would we do without you? 
We must celebrate this day every year, said another. The day of Elmer's best joke. All of us elephants will decorate ourselves in his honor, said a third. And Elmer will decorate himself elephant color. And one day each year, the elephant colors themselves yellow or orange or red or pink or purple or blue or green or black or white and have a big parade. If you happen to see an elephant in the Elmer's Day Parade who is ordinary elephant color, you will know it must be Elmer. And that's the end of our book. Thanks for listening, guys.